Hello friends, in this AV, we are going to take up the numericals of the fourth chapter of class 10 physics that is refraction of light at plane surfaces. We will be talking about the numericals of exercise 4a and we will be solving all the four numericals. Before that, let's take a look at the formulas that we are going to use to solve the numericals of this exercise. First of all, we will be using the speed of light v is equal to frequency multiplied by wavelength. We might not need this formula but we are supposed to know. Then the second formula is about the refractive index which is denoted as mu. So refractive index is equal to speed of light in vacuum or air divided by the speed of light in that medium for whichever medium that we have to find out. It may be water, it may be glass. Now, refractive index of medium 2 with respect to 1 is speed of light in medium 1 divided by speed of light in medium 2. So here I have written for you refractive index of medium 2 with respect to medium 1. Now, Here, refractive index of medium 2 with respect to medium 1, if the speed of light is not given and we have been given the refractive index of two different mediums, then that is denoted, uh, that is given as refractive index of medium 2 divided by refractive index of medium 1. And we have to remember that refractive index of medium 2 with respect to medium 1 multiplied by refractive index of medium 1 with respect to medium 2 is always equal to 1. Now the first question of this exercise it says that the speed of light in air is 3 into 10 raised to the power 8 meter per second. We have to calculate the speed of light in glass. We have also been provided the refractive index of glass. So we know the formula that refractive index is equal to speed of light in air divided by the speed of light in that medium. So the medium that we are talking about here is glass. So we have written the given things. Speed of light in air is 3 into 10 raised to the power 8 meter per second. Refractive index of glass is 1.5. So we know the formula. Refractive index is equal to speed of light in air divided by speed of light in the medium or the given medium. So we have to find this value, the speed of light in the given medium. So we take it on the left hand side and we rewrite the equation in terms of this. The speed of light in the given medium will be equal to speed of light in air divided by the refractive index. So speed of light in the air is given as 3 into 10 raised to the power 8 meter per second divided by the refractive index 1.5. So if you divide 1.5 twice is 3. So 2 into 10 raised to the power 8 meter per second is the answer for this question. Now question number 2. It says the speed of light in diamond is 1,25,000 kilometer per second. Now we will have to convert it into meter per second by multiplying it with 1000. What is its refractive index given that speed of light in air is this much. So again we have to use the same formula and it's a very straightforward question except the conversion of kilometer per second into meter per second. So we have written the speed of light in diamond is 1,25,000 kilometer per second. When we convert it to meter per second, we just multiply it with 1,000. So we have written it as 125 into 10 raised to the power 6 meter per second. Then the speed of light in air is given to us as 3 into 10 raised to the power 8 meter per second. So we use the formula. We know refractive index is equal to speed of light in air divided by the speed of light in that medium. So the values are given here, we just put it 3 into 10 raised to the power 8 meter per second that is the speed of light in air divided by 125 multiplied by 10 raised to the power 6 meter per second that is the speed of light in diamond. So after division the answer comes out to be 2.4.
Now, moving on to the next question, question number three. It says, the refractive index of water with respect to air is 4 by 3. What is the refractive index of air with respect to water? So, if you have watched this AV since the beginning, I had told you about a formula uh, which says that the fifth formula here you can see that uh, refractive index of medium 2 with respect to medium 1 multiplied by refractive index of medium 1 with respect to 2 is equal to 1. So, one of the items we can take to the other side then the value of this can be found out. So, we are going to use this only for solving question number 3. So, I have written given the refractive index of water with respect to air is 4 by 3. So, the refractive index of air with respect to water will be mu air and water is equal to 1 by refractive index of water with respect to air. So, 1 by 4 by 3 it becomes 3 by 4 and when you divide it you get the answer as 0.75. Now, we move on to the last question. It says, a ray of light of wavelength 5400 angstrom suffers refraction from air to glass. Taking the refractive index of glass with respect to air as 3 by 2, we have to find the wavelength of light in glass. Now, for this question, we will be using the formula of for refractive index but instead of speed we are going to take the wavelength so here you can see I have written the given things wavelength of light in air is 5400 angstrom refractive index of glass with respect to air is 3 by 2 this has been given to us so we use the formula refractive index of glass with respect to air is equal to wavelength of light in air divided by wavelength of light in glass. Now, we have the value of this that is 3 by 2 that is the refractive index of glass with respect to air. So, we write it as 3 by 2 is equal to wavelength of light in air has been given to us as 5400 angstrom divided by the wavelength of light in glass that is the entity that has to be found out. So from here you take this entity to the other side and bring 3 down and multiply 2 up that is cross multiplication. So you will have some the equation something like this wavelength of light in glass is equal to here it was 3 by 2 so uh, taking it to the other side it becomes 2 by 3 multiplied by 5400 angstrom and when you calculate you will get 3600 angstrom so that's all we have in this av for you happy learning god bless